In this video, we're going to talk about how to properly set up a calendar in OpenEMR. As you can see, I'm on the calendar and I'm on January 2022, which was what I scheduled my last patient for. But what we're going to do now is go back to today. So if I click on today, it takes me back to the current date uh, for today. In order to schedule or properly set up a calendar for a provider, I'm going to select that provider and then I can click any time slot on the calendar itself. When I click the time slot, I want to go to provider. If you notice the provider that I have selected, which is Lee, Donna Lee, and then I'm going to select the in office time. Because if you notice in our previous video, when we tried to schedule a patient for Billy Smith, it said that there was no available appointments. And available appointments, if you click right here, it will tell you that it can't find anything because, of course, it's not properly set up. So in order to properly set that up, you would select your in time. Now, the out time on your calendar is set by the globals. In the globals, there is an hour, hours of operation that is set in the globals. So that's going to set your out time by default. You can change that by setting an out time if you want to change what the out time is for that day or for that period of time. In this case, we're going to be setting the end time for our provider and we're going to have them come in at, and I should have picked the proper time. Let's go back and I'm going to cancel this and I'm going to pick 9 a.m. So our provider comes in at 9 a.m. and this is We'll schedule all these appointments after that, even though the clinic opens up at 8 in this particular case. And of course, you can set, if you had different clinics, you can set the provider schedule for each of the different clinics. So provider comes in at 9 a.m. And then we're going to have it to repeat. And I'm going to tell it every work day. You can change this as necessary as whatever combination of times that you need. So. Workday is going to be set according to the calendar from the globals. If the globals are set to have the work week start on Monday and end on Saturday, that will be your work days. You do not need to set a duration, but you will need to set an end date. In this case, we're going to set our end date for, and by the way, I would recommend that you only set it for at the most two years out. But for this demonstration purposes, we're only going to set it to December of this year. So it's going to repeat every workday till December 2021. And now I can set a default category for my provider that he sees patients the most in, or I can leave it blank. And so it has to be set when at the appointment time at this one, I'm just going to go ahead and set this established and then I'm ready to go. So I'm going to tell it save. Now, if you notice the blue background that comes up on my calendar, if I go to the week view of my calendar and move forward to the next week, you'll see that all of these here are now blue with an end time and an out time of 1730 because that's what's set in my globals. 